uh, made it up here, but not by the incline railway. It was sold out for today, but made it to the, the point anyway. On a clear day, you can see clear to Kentucky, clear to Virginia. And if you just go right over here, you'll see Alabama over this way and Georgia down there to the south. I thought it was seven different states. But down here along the interstate, you can see Norfolk Southern. There's some greeners. There's the tracks. Okay. Trying to find downtown. There we go. <laughs> well, there it is. Downtown Chattanooga. Tennessee River. You know, at one time, all that valley was filled in. Of course, where I'm at, it was a little higher too, but that Tennessee River has meandered so many millions of years back and forth and eroded this whole lower elevation out. We're about 2,800 foot elevation. Chattanooga is about 680 foot elevation. So we're quite a bit of ways above. I bet at night it's nice here. This right here Can't see nothing in this camera. Man. Yeah, there's Roper's Rock. Another lookout point. This is the little town of Dalton. sure what that is. Looks like some kind of plant. Here's some point.
tracks are down there too. You know when I was little we lived in Arkansas we'd go up highway 7 to Booker Holler and Cliff House and it was about the same elevation as we are here I think it's somewhere around four or five degrees cooler every thousand foot elevation but in this part of the country though you could have a temperature inversion and it'd be warmer up here than it is in the valley so it depends on your weather pattern your weather system in the area at the time you're up here or any mountain but it, it was like 67 in Chattanooga and then it was 64 up here the temperature inversion doesn't happen that often but you get a weather pattern in the lower levels of the atmosphere you'll get a lot of gulf air get the subtropical jet stream that comes in and brings warmer air above it overrides the cool weather down in the valley but for the most part it's cooler the further you go up wish I could zoom in on a freight train kind of a park area might be lucky to live here